Education is these children's key to their future. And so getting to see those children walk in that lab, open their eyes and watch them light up. Ready, set. <laughs> and they say to me, this is my classroom, like this is where I get to learn. <laughs> like me, I get to touch the computer now. And like that's just not something they ever thought was even in their reach. The world is changing. I want to be part of that world. If I use a computer, I can be a part of that world. Hello, everyone at the Global Summit. Um, for those of you who I met last year, thank you for everything that you promised to us that you made possible this year and that you turned into a reality. While we have grown, there are hundreds and hundreds of children standing outside our gates waiting every single day to go to school. And so we are always looking for more education donors. Our goal is to not finish with these children when they are 18 years old, like many orphanages and other foster care systems do around the world. We want to take these children all the way through their university years, to their masters, until they get a job. And that way we are 100% sure that that child will be out of the cycle of poverty, and that that child will have a shot at their dream, at a beautiful future, at a beautiful family, and a beautiful life. This is the girls' dormitory. Technology in general, especially for an area like Kitandu, where you are completely off the grid, where there is no electricity, it means a lot. Out here in Uru, Aero opened huge doors for us this year by supplying us with internet. What we have found about technology is it's not just the doors it opens, it has made us such a well-rounded center, and there are so many more things that we can do. To date, Aero has supplied us with five students' educations, a DigiTruck that is a fully solar computer lab, playground, 50 tablets, and they paid for part of our solar electricity for the center. This was huge. This is classroom B from Tulane Academy. Wow. Children coming from this center now seem to be the best, most well-rounded children in their schools. People look at NEMA students as the best students. Arrow inspired us with this donation of the DigiTruck. As of last week, all 19 children who we started with in the DigiTruck are officially re-enrolled in a government-certified school. What number is this? Here we do have a five student to one teacher ratio. Some of these children, due to the backgrounds they're from, it is still not enough. Yet with tablets or with computers, every child has their own teacher inside that machine. And that has opened a world of opportunity for them. For us here in Uru, this playground has given these children a chance to play and to laugh and to swing and to slide, which was a huge deal. This was a chance to give these children their lives back. Thank you, Anne.